Do I do it from here? At the center, wherever you want, actually. Okay. <laughs> Are you going to stand there? You're going to help me? If you need my help, yes. willingly. <laughs> nice to see all of you. Nice to see all of you. Uh, kombu chicken is very good. I enjoyed uh, Chimek with my friends, and uh, it is the best way to enjoy Korea. I enjoyed it very much. Uh, thank you for the opportunity to, to address you today. Uh, and first of all, congratulations on, on such an incredibly successful APEC. Uh, it tells you something about uh, the, the ability for Korea uh, to attract, to unite, and of course, uh, Chairman uh, Tony Che's uh, incredible work to uh, organize uh, what, is, what is a historic APEC. And so I want to congratulate you for that. Um, the industry, as you know, the computer industry that NVIDIA is part of is going through a fundamental transformation. And every single industry, because computers are affect, affect and impact every single industry, it is the single most important instrument of humanity today, every single industry is being impacted as a result of a platform shift we call artificial intelligence. Our journey, our journey started over 30 years ago to invent a new way of doing computing. The computing approach that we created and invented is called accelerated computing. We acknowledge, we recognized years ago to create a new computing model to solve problems normal computers cannot. It has another benefit that when Moore's law runs out of steam, it could be the path forward for the computer industry. 33 years later, as we continue to be able to create more transistors with every generation of process technology. And even though transistors' performance and power benefits have slowed tremendously, we can now continue to expand computing for as far as we can see because of accelerated computing. We are now seeing a platform shift. This platform shift is, was the reason for creating the GPU and inventing the model we call CUDA. However, a GPU alone is just a chip. This new computing approach requires tremendous amounts of algorithm software to be developed. We call it CUDA X libraries. Very few people talk about this, but this is NVIDIA's treasure. These libraries make it possible for us to apply accelerated computing to computational lithography, the work that we do with Samsung, or in deep learning and robotics, the work that we do with many companies here that I'll talk about. It allows us to do quantum physics. It allows us to do quantum computing, molecular dynamics, fluid dynamics, robotics, of course, artificial intelligence. These libraries open new markets for our company. These libraries are precisely the reason why NVIDIA's computing approach is now available all over the world in so many different industries. But it started from a very humble beginning. And so I made a short video for you to give you a feeling for what NVIDIA's technology can do today. It has been 33 years. In fact, I've been coming to Korea, NVIDIA came to Korea 30 years ago. We invented the video game industry together. I introduced GeForce here to Korea 25 years ago. And last night, we had a big celebration with the esports gamers and PC gamers here in Korea, it was incredibly fun to celebrate GeForce 25, 25 years of GeForce. And so I made you a short video, that, but as you're watching this, remember, nothing here is animated. Everything is simulated. Everything I will show you is mathematics, mathematics, computer algorithms that make it possible for us to do what I'm about to show you. Please run it. Ready, go! 